Hey you guys. Cut go again. Hang on. I'm meant to be training. Yep. Welcome back, Tina. Hang on, Greg. Not so fast. This is really good of you, Trevor. Sure you can spare the time? No, right, no problem. Get a few pounds in for manpower like. We'll have it up in no time. No, right. cheers man. Cheers. What's that? My dad started work on the wheelway. Can I help dad? Aye, of course. We missed you, Joe. The video's nearly finished if you want to see it. I don't know. We need you. I was actually thinking of helping me dad. Hey, smashing. <laughs> Mine, she's a tussy one, isn't she? Yeah. I've got you deep in the heart of me. You didn't sit there singing all day. I thought you came to the Grove to spend some time with me. Well, I need to practice. I can practice at home, I can practice here with you. I'd sacrifice anything, come up my for the sake of having you near. In spite of a warning voice that comes in the What are you doing? Spending quality time with her boyfriend. Don't you know, little fool, you never can win. Use your mentality, face up to reality. Can't we have something a little less whiny? What's the matter with you? I wish I knew. Something happened last night. What? Me and Ben. We ended up kissing. You and Ben? When did you start fancying him? I don't. Do. No, I don't just happened. I had nothing to do with it, hardly. He was the one that came onto me. What, so you just stood there and let him? I was in shock, wasn't I? Really? She just went up to you and stuck her lips on you? Did you know that she fancied you? I thought you went for geeky types. Are you going out with her? No, I'm not interested. Can you imagine going out with Nicky? It'd be like, nag, nag, nag. Ah, uh, you probably want to stay away from her, like. Too right. I worked dead hard for these. You should be proud of yourself. Glad to be back. You bet. <laughs> Here's to the future. <laughs> I know this is a bit cheeky, but I said Dom could come and have a look around. This afternoon? Yeah, sure, why not? I'd like to meet him. Oh, fab. <laughs> Will you listen to this? It's Matt's DJ demo. And why didn't he bring me the demo? It's not easy for him to come here when everyone's so against him. I told him to make his mind up. If you made him DJ, it's more of an incentive for him to come back. But that wouldn't be fair on the other hopefuls. Things haven't exactly been fair for Matt. Just listen to the tape, please. Hello? I've brought your phone. It's Nikki. Come in. I haven't got time. She sounds dead keen, doesn't she? I'll leave it on the step. No, hang on. Quick, look for biscuits. No, I've got a better idea. Why aren't you coming in? I told you I'm busy. Right, I'm off. Well, you're really going to leave it on the step? You've got it now. Safe and sound, what's your problem? Because it's other people's property. How would you like them to run through your stuff like this? I brought it back for you, didn't I? Don't know why you bothered, mind. Yeah, well, you should have brought it back sooner. It's my lifeline, this phone. Don't worry, nobody called. I hope you didn't read any of the text messages. Like I'm interested. <laughs> What's wrong with it? Must be bust. You right there, son? Yeah, fine. Good lad. Joe, can I have a word? I'm a bit busy. He's told you. He's not interested in your video. I only want to ask his opinion. Never mind. Don't let her get to you. You don't need the hassle. I know that. Hey, I think she's got her eye on you. You know what I mean, hey? No. Yeah, I don't be daft. Guess what? We'll all come to the race tomorrow. Tina's borrowing the minibus so we can all come and support you. Here, John at the first position. Well, it's not exactly like that. I mean, there's different categories. Don't you want us to come? Well, no, but if you born for you? Of course they won't. Who's coming to watch Greg when he's raised tomorrow? We'll be there. I'll be there. Mukasa, how about you? What's this? No, mine. You don't say. 
I thought Mukasa might like them. Help with his English. Stegosaurus and Velociraptor. Try using those in conversation. We'll have to make an effort. You can't live somewhere and not learn the lingo. I will learn Jody Kenny good. <laughs> See? <laughs> What do you think you're doing? I can't drink out of plastic. Lou only got those for me. Look, I don't care what you're into. I'll stick the glassware, okay? She's had a charming best again today. Lou wants us to take her at the club night tomorrow, you know. No way, I'm not going anywhere with Angina. We have no choice. <laughs> I think she's got a boyfriend. <laughs> See? I told you. <laughs> a casual. You two spying on me! As if. Who's your friend? Ah, you'll find out soon enough. Is he up there? Well, it looks like it, doesn't it? Yeah. I hate working sideways. You here working full stop? Are you watching? You nearly smiled there. I didn't. Hey! Hey, what are you doing? Hey! I'm sorry. Look what you made us do! Through yesterday. You did tell him it was a one off song. I told you. I'm having nothing to do with him from now on. Have you seen Greg anywhere? He's at home waiting for you. I called on him, there was no one in. Well, you better hurry up. The race will be starting soon. Do you think something's happening to him? We should look for him. Yeah, I'll check for him. Right, I'll come with you. Where's our star racer? I was hoping you might tell me that. I can see you, Alan. Wait. Alan. What about the other day? I did wrong, didn't I? Well, sort of. But I shouldn't have shouted at you, and I'm sorry. I'm sorry as well. Do you want to give us a hand? Uh, I, I don't know. You'd be helping us a lot if you took this. The Sunday papers. I've seen how thick they are. Tell you what, I'll fold them and you can put them through the letterbox, eh? Okay. Greg, what are you doing? We've been looking everywhere for you. You shouldn't have bothered. The race is about to start. I'm not going to do it. Why not? Everyone's waiting for you. We'll just have to go home disappointed them, won't they? What's up, Greg? They're all expecting too much. We do without the pressure. It's not funny. I know. Listen, it wasn't too long ago that you were mourning because you were sick of being pitied. You can't have it both ways. Slow down! I've got to go home! You'll turn up, I know you will. Trust us. Never. It's Greg's race! He's gonna miss it! Put a sock in it, Stella! He's here! Where have you been? Need to think. Of all the times to take up philosophy. Break a leg! Where do you find him? Just down the road. He was psyching himself up. Good luck.
What do you think you're doing? I'm sorry. Mikasa, are you alright? Yes, I think you have to go. What's the hurry? Are they giving you trouble? No, no trouble. Please. Refugees, go home! I, I go. Refugees, go home! Refugees, go home! Refugees, go home! Oh, get lost! How long has this been going on? Mikasa? I don't understand. I think you do. Come on. We'll walk you home. No. It's no need. Plenty need. Do you like my hat? Yes, it's um cushy. Is this where you live? Yeah, it's horrible. Why are the windows boarded up? And where did the newspapers go? Stones and uh, what are they? Bricks. Yes, bricks. Who did this, Makassa? Who threw the bricks? We don't see faces. Maybe they don't like the house. So he forgave you for beating him then? Yeah, Pete's alright. He's came from London for the race. All that way to come second. Greg, we've been looking for you all over. Where have you been? Did you make the race? How did you do? What? What are you watching? Oh, it's just some stuff that Jamie did at the hamsters. Let us show you the video, Joe. Go on. Look, I said I'd watch it with everyone else. We've only got a little bit of do, and then we're finished. You can even direct it if you want. Please, Joe. What do you think of the grill, Paul? It's really good. All my friends, come here. I've just had an idea. Have we got this in the video? No. It's just Jamie doing stupid voices. Joe, what are you doing? Dad's looking for you. No, right. Well, come on then. What about your idea? It doesn't matter. Can I have some volunteers for a banner painting? Okay. Who's here? Everyone, this is Don. Hi. I was going to save the announcement until later, but... I love it. You're getting married, ain't you? Well, I don't think that's allowed between brother and sisters. <laughs> He's your brother? Yeah. Don was thinking about doing some youth work. Yeah, I'm just here to observe tonight, so uh, you won't even notice so. Come on, let's go. What about Anjali? Lou said we had to take her to the club night. Well, we can't take her, we can't find her. She's in her room. Is she? Angina! Angina! No, see? Can't save it and try. Come on. Hi, you'll be Dom. I'm Stella. Have you got a girlfriend? Geordie? No, not at the moment. See, all you had to do was ask. It's not going to happen again. You said that this morning and yesterday, twice. I know, but I mean at this time. I'm staying well away from Ben. I should think so too. Claire's meant to be a mate. She put her feelings first. Will you just keep that out? Congratulations, Greg. Thanks. Yeah, well done. You deserve some success. Here we go again. Trust me, I've got a good feeling about tonight. I was talking to Pete. The lad from London? Yeah. He said there's a job going down the sports centre he uses. A specialist one for the disabled. Nice one. 
Is he going to apply? That's a thing. He sort of suggested I apply for it. I'd be able to use all the facilities. But I'd miss you. Sorry, it's not what you want to hear. You should go for it. It's not as simple as that. We're talking about London. I'd be there on my own, without backup. Don't know if I can do it. You're a champion. Look at what you pulled off today. Only just. And I nearly lost my nerve, Sarah. Besides, it's much bigger than just one race. So what do you think to our little setup? Yeah, it's great. Wouldn't mind being a Grover myself, actually. <laughs> <laughs> Did you get to listen to Matt's demo tape? No. Oh, come on. You're not the only candidate for DJ. There are two others. But Matt's the best. Ah, it doesn't matter, Paul. Look, all you have to do is get out there and play a set. That's what the others are going to do. The one who wins a popular vote gets a job. But as soon as they see Matt, they're not going to listen to his tunes. Exactly. Uh, there is one other option. Come on, we're dancing. I don't think so. Why not? Because. Hey, how things? Fine. Come on, Leon. Stay away from little boys. We have something a bit more sophisticated to come along. Like Dom, you mean? I thought it was all over between you and Leon. It is now. Best decision you ever made? You want to give it a try? The stage is yours. Okay. Contestant number three. Wait here. I can't do this. It just wouldn't work. The best thing we could do was just forget what happened. Cool. I don't fancy you, you know. I don't fancy you either. Good. Fine. What's going on between you two? No. Yeah. Are you seeing each other? No way. Ladies and gentlemen, tonight you, the audience, will be choosing the Grog's new resident DJ from three surprise contestants. Who's he? Dom, Tina's brother. Good looking, isn't he? No. Yes, he is. He's gorgeous. Better looking than him anyway. So. Which DJ will triumph, ladies and gents, the audience? The choice is yours. Yay! This is take number one. Okay, take two. Go on. Have a go. Go on. I've been thinking, mate. I want to have a try at this idea for the video. Really? Yeah, maybe tomorrow. What about the wheel wheel? You don't let your dad down. I know. I'll think of something, okay? It's good to have you back, too. And finally, DJ number three. Now, you lot, you know what you do. You listen, then you dance, then you vote. Like this one? Is it Matt? You must be shattered after today. That was good. So, did you miss it? No, don't answer that. Brother's all right. You sound. Yeah. Great. So, who will be the lucky winner? Well, the DJs have done their job. Now it's your turn. When I hold up these tapes, I want you all to vote using noise and plenty of it. 
So, Biker Grove's new resident DJ, will it be contestant number one? <laughs> or will it be contestant number two? No, no, I think number one's still in with a good chance there. Or will it be contestant number three? <laughs> well, I think we have a winner. Ladies and gents, please make some noise and welcome onto stage Biker Grove's new resident DJ, contestant number three! Yeah. You're joking. It's a fix. What are you doing? He was the best and you know it. Nah, it's okay, Paul. I knew this was going to happen. Do you see why I didn't want to come back? There's your answer. I tried my best, but it's not good enough, is it? So I made a mistake. How long do I have to keep on paying? But you can't do this. Ah, it doesn't matter. What's the point? Don't follow him. Ben! Matt! Follow them win, Matt! What's the point? How can I fight the whole grove? It's not the whole grove. Not anymore. You were right. You've paid for what you did. I don't get it. Why are you being like this? If we can call a truce with the burners, we can do the same with you. How about it, Matt? I think you had a cheek coming back. Maybe we should give him another chance. I mean, if Ben thinks it's okay... Oh, no! Oh, what's she doing here? Hi. Coward, I can see ya! Ignore her, she'll just go away. I don't think so. You were supposed to wait for me! You were supposed to bring me here! We forgot! Liar! Hey! Hey, 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 calm down! Why are you just going? You're not wanted here! What did you have to say that for? Come on now. Put that down. You spoke my night. Well, it's payback! Take it easy, okay? But don't go near her, she's mad! Will you keep your stupid up? Remember Leslie? Yeah, she's the woman with the power. They've graffitied all over the side of your house saying refugee go home. But he's definitely coming back. Yes. Horrible. I saw it. Uh, what's that? Nobody's gonna put you away. Oh,